Hello everyone, welcome to this tutorial. We are going to uh, calculate efficient wind cooling. You will probably experience a lower temperature than what the thermometer shows when it is uh, windy. But which one temper uh, which one temperature is what you experience? SMHI uses the formula of Uzevsky uh, and Bluestein uh, to calculate the effective temperature as the follow equation uh, where n is the wind speed and t is the temperature and then uh, we are going to uh, use write a program to show us that uh, monster and it must have the uh, the winds affect on temperature uh, present in uh, a, a nice table as follow and uh, the table has uh, many rows but uh, the first is the uh, uh, temperature dot uh, calculated in Celsius and then we are going to have 10 8 6 4 2 0 minus 2 to minus 30 and then uh, we have a lot of columns it's uh, another first column is the uh, wind uh, velocity and the meter each second and then uh, we have a line and then we have uh, two column for 6, 8 until 26 and we are going to have uh, calculate all those uh, values from the uh, from this uh, uh, this uh, uh, formula and put it here under each place and if the value is less than min minus 26 is going to highlight it is going to highlight it okay we are going to start a program new project console application and it must be included these f uh, values and then uh, the class program has a static int a matrix T effective new int 1321 uh, 21 column and 13 uh, rows and uh, in uh, main method we are going to uh, define an integer T with uh, those values and wind with those values and a string s wind meter each second and then uh, console for for a ground color is gray and console set window size 91 to 25 it must have a size that it can uh, it can show that uh, space and then uh, we are going to put console right line that one which indicates uh, that part and then we are going to use temperature affection on Y as followed in table below and you are going to use that uh, uh, signs and then you are going to have a right line and another line with a, a straight uh, 
uh, sign and you are going to use temperature in uh, uh, Celsius and then another right line and you are going to use the first temperature is 10 and so on you are going to use a, a right a amount of uh, spaces and it is all, uh, almost until here console right not right long right and you are going to use all those and continue here down here continue here until 16 and continue here with until 20 and then you are going to have a that uh, dashed line under this and uh, now we are going to use for int i from 0 until 13 it is for y and from 0 until 21 for temperature t effective i and j is implicit integer of math round that number plus that number multiplied by tj minus that number multiplied by math power v of i up to 0 0.16 plus that value multiplied by tj multiplied by math power this value over you are going to calculate this and if i less than 2 the first and second row hasn't any extra string as first column as you see here the first and second is empty you are going to only use that one and it is uh, this this line and then this line and if I between two less than four you are going to use the this uh, this uh, string and this uh, string is in S and YI and print temp I and then uh, print temp of I and it is a method we are calling here and here it has been calculated with uh, those uh, uh, variables and uh, we are coming back later and if i between 4 and i less than 12 you are going to put another string and y i and print temp i else you are going to put the rest of the uh, value of wine and in print m temp you are going to use i j from 0 until 21 if uh, tf bigger than minus 28 you are going to only put the value with the uh, four spaces that value with four spaces else you must change the uh, the color you are going to use background color console color dark blue 
foreground color console color white and uh, it is dark blue and the numbers must be uh, highlighted and then uh, you are going to put the values with four spaces and then you, you, are, you are going to use reset color it must be otherwise the whole table is uh, below and it is finished okay it was that one and that part you are copy in that part you are copy and that part you are copy and that part you are copying and that part it must be the same now we are running the program shows that it's reading it's compiling and you have all those values and it is okay if you are using higher it's going to be another that is because you have used the correct space of the window okay it was all in this tutorial see you on next tutorial